What's up everyone, iShock here. In this video I'm going to show you where to find the new harvestable boxes and crates on the Fjordor map. You can get metal tools, crossbows, weapons, hundreds of hard polymer, obsidian, metal scraps, and even cooked metal ingots. So if you're just getting started or deep into progression, you're going to want to stick around and see all the locations and loot. There are quite a few locations spread around the map, so let's take a look and see which ones benefit you the most. Let's start off on the east side of Vanilland and work our way back to the west along the beach. You can use the free teleport function by holding R on PC and choosing Vanilland South, then choose East option and you will arrive instantly at the first location, roughly 4498, right on the beach. You should be able to spot a shipwreck half in the water nearby. These are one of the indicators that there are harvestable special loot boxes nearby. The first boxes will give you primitive hatchet, pickaxe, crossbows, and spears. The good barrels will give you cooked meat and spoiled meat, and the broken barrels will give you metal scraps of wood. Scraps are good metal as they convert one to one to ingots, unlike raw metal which is two raw metal to make one ingot, twice the weight to carry. Also you can harvest the very first by hand or better by stone, but once you get a metal tool you should use that as it seems to give more the better tool quality. I also tried using a chainsaw and it worked well but it's not necessary at all. If these crates are news to you, be sure to subscribe, I've got many more awesome tips and tricks videos on the way. The next available spot's just a little more south along the beach, but still in the southeastern shore of Vanillan. The cords are 6087. I realize these starter ones are a little repetitive, but if you're on a fresh start server and people are aware, they're likely to all be farmed up, so I wanted to show many locations so you might not even need to teleport. And last along this beach line is going to be about 4044, and you'll find another wrecked ship on the beach indicating there are harvestable boxes nearby. Next we'll head over to Balamir north side and you'll once again find a shipwreck with boxes and barrels nearby around 7581. This is a kind of dangerous island so be careful a wyvern or basilisk doesn't pop up and end your life. Next we're going to teleport to Vardy Land north, the north option on the wheel. Here you'll once again find a ship on the shore and lots of boxes around 5228. Head just a bit east and you'll find another shipwreck at 7040 ready to be farmed. These two spots are pretty loaded and easy to get to. You can also farm some easy organic polymer off the penguins around here. Use a club to gain the most. If you were to continue down the beach line south, you'll find the last ship location I have to show you. Right around 8936. So let's gather up those goods and head to the hard polymer location I'm sure you're all waiting for. Now for the hard poly, metal, and obsidian, you're going to want to head to 1163, where you'll find this massive dwarf cave. Once you head inside, you'll find an anvil with a few large boxes stacked around it. These boxes give the hard poly, obsidian, and metal ingots ready to go. Definitely one of the best ways to get a good amount of hard poly early on or even late game. Thanks everyone. Please show your support by liking and subscribing if you learned something from this video. I have many more Fjordor specific videos in the works and lots more ARK survival guides to help you progress to your new best. Thanks everyone. Peace.